Thanks. So right now, we're learning of the passing of an Atlantic, Atlanta music mogul, Claiborne Evans. The music executive, known by many as Grand Hustle, died yesterday after suffering complications from a stroke. 11 Alive's Karis Belger spoke with a longtime friend and colleague about his impact on the Atlanta music scene. I do. I like to be out in the mix, and I like to be a part of part of someone's history. Music executive Clay Evans once said he didn't mind being behind the scenes. His longtime friend and collaborator Curtis Daniel III says that work was key to his impact. It's important that people don't forget who helped lay some of these foundational bricks here in Atlanta and Clay was definitely one of those guys. Daniel is the co-owner of Patchwork Studios in West Midtown. He says he met Clay Evans in July of 1995 when he was trying to get things off the ground. And Daniel says without Evans, Patchwork would not exist. Clay is one of the few people that can say he was there since day one. He was um, super instrumental in, um, in getting us some credibility and helping us secure our first clients. Clients that included hip-hop duo OutKast. The 54-year-old music executive died earlier this week. His family taking to Instagram to share the news, saying in part he lived an extraordinary life filled with love, hard work and laughter, and he touched many lives. Since then, tributes have been pouring in, including posts from rapper T.I. and comedian Lil Duvall, whom Clay managed. Daniel says the posts he's seen are exactly how he wants people to remember his dear friend. Clay was consistent. Clay was solid. Clay was a stand-up guy. Clay helped me. Clay was hilarious. And he hopes Evan's impact on the culture will continue to take center stage. Kara Spelger, 11 Alive News. We have more on the life of Clay Evans online at 11alive.com.